Hey everybody, this is Matt with iPad TV News coming at you with part two of our four part series on the Dish Anywhere service for your web browser. This is like having a satellite dish with you anywhere you have access to the internet. Today we're going to be talking about the My DVR section, which is literally like having your DVR with you anywhere you go. You can see You've got your four categories here. You've got your recordings. You've got prime time, anytime. you got your daily schedule and my timers. You click on your recordings, and it's literally just a list of all of the shows that you record. If you click the title, you can see all your episodes here. You can choose to watch them. You can choose to delete the ones that you've already seen. Next up, we're going to look at your prime time, anytime category. This is something you have to set up from your DVR at home. What this is is it records literally all of the primetime programming for all the major networks so you can watch it whenever you want fox nbc abc cbs now as you can imagine that uses a lot of dvr space so you have to set that up manually next up you've got your daily schedule which shows programs that are scheduled to be recorded in the near future and you've also got your my timer section this allows you to fine tune it a little bit here you can see you can choose to only record new episodes, record all episodes, prepare it for your iPad. You can choose to start earlier or end late just in case you don't want to miss any part of the program. You can choose the maximum number of episodes you want in your DVR at any one time in case you want to not record more than seven. And you can choose the priority number that it takes in the queue. So if there's other shows being recording at the same time, they might take precedent over this one. And basically what you're going to see here is whenever you choose the show you want to watch is it works exactly like your DVR at home. It's really remarkable how much control you have over it. You've got the option you can watch it in HD, you can watch it in good quality, not necessarily the best. Uh, you can fast forward, you can rewind, you can pause, you can jump forward, you can jump backwards, you can change the channels like just like you're watching at home. Now as you can see here we're watching Tasho. This ends right before the Daily Show starts, so I'm going to fast forward a little bit. You know, I'm going to switch over to HD, and the quality looks great. I mean, I don't have to buy it off iTunes. I don't have to buy individual episodes. I don't have to subscribe to the podcast or whatever. I've got it all here on my internet browser in HD. I can control it, fast forward, do whatever. It's, it's a beautiful thing. That's going to do it for part two of our four-part series on the Dish Anywhere service. Make sure you join us for part three where we're going to be talking to you about the live TV components. Very exciting stuff. It's like having a TV with you on the go. Thanks again for watching. This is Matt with iPad TV News.